Back in about 2005, staff were being inundated for the request to use public land here in Alberta. Uh, their time was being spent dealing with the paperwork and the uh, administrative responsibilities back in the office. They were not able to get to the field to see what was actually happening as a result of approving numerous applications for the use of public land. The mobile office has freed up our field staff to get back into the field. We are now able to make better quality decisions when it comes to natural resource management. We can do emergency response, we can do uh, wildlife and fisheries management, we can do land management in an improved way with the data now available at these guys' fingertips. Now they're able to be more productive, more time spent in the field, quality of decision making has been increased, and client service has been improved. Sustainable resource development is now more efficient and effective on delivering on its programs as a result of the use of the Mobile Office Initiative. For Enforcement's Mobile Office, it's been a valuable tool for us. Um, it allows us to get out of the office more and spend more time in the field showing a presence. We have a, a GPS, a spot unit, that's designated for each officer and it can be tracked. For officer safety, that's very big. We do uh, a lot of checks. Sometimes they'll have uh, fishing licenses, sometimes they won't carry it. Uh, if we have cell service, we can get out with our mobile office unit and verify the fishing licenses. Part of the problem with some of these guys, they use different aliases or they may have been checked. In the old days, it would just have been a paper trail and the different officers would never know who's been checked and who hasn't. With this mobile office, it's up to date. So if he's a, a repeat offender, we can deal with him accordingly. In past, uh, we used to end up taking paper files out of the office and put, transporting them in our trucks. With mobile office, we're allowed to research, retrieve them electronically, and as soon as we shut our computer down, they're locked and secure. We can track uh, people, uh, vehicles, and relay them in between officers almost immediately without a paper copy. The field came to us and they said they wanted to uh, be able to, to be at location with the information that was appropriate for their needs. Our biggest problem was to amass a large volume of data to meet a diverse set of user needs across the province. Uh, SRD has a wide range of divisions that are, uh, that are within it that uh, each have their own individual needs along with a core set of needs of data. The data itself is as soon as it's updated, uh, it actually gets put into the core repositories for delivery to the field. As they use their iMod tool, that data is pulled directly to the machine. When they actually update data from the field, that information is, is directly inputted into the corporate store, so it's real time. As soon as they're done their updates and they use the iMod tool to update their data, they get a fresh copy of the information, and that's completely up to date across province. The overall uh, mobile office program to me, it's kind of like a one stop shopping, it allows me to perform quality inspection reports and achieve more uh, inspection ports and allows me to spend more time in the field. For me, it's about the data, the information uh, that I can use in the field. I can connect with clients, I can connect back at the office on databases and update information. Having that information available for the clients so we can plan better on the land base. We can look at issues uh, together uh, the, that we identify during the inspection. It benefits them so they can take the information and plan from it. And, and then correct the action that needs to be done. The mobile office has allowed us to receive more accurate information so that we can uh, budget and plan our work and deliver safe and responsible oil and gas development in the province. Prior to the mobile office technology, uh, we were uh, forced into a reactive approach and now we're very proactive, meaning that uh, we can make sure that we're meeting all of our obligations and commitments uh, on, in our assets. The mobile office is improving and strengthening the relationship uh, that we have working with our regulators. It's another way that uh, industry and, and the government are working together to ensure safe and reliable uh, development. For the mobile office, it gives us quick response to wildfires, providing digital data back to the office. Uh, for forestry, it gives us the ability to complete more inspections and direct input for the forest monitoring operations program. 
communications are important so the duty officer in our fire center is getting accurate information to dispatch the appropriate resources, be it air tankers, dozers, or additional helicopters and crews. We don't have to gather maps and paper information. We just grab our computer and go. The advantage of having it instantaneous is as you're flying, your perimeter's being calculated. You know how much hose line you need, how much machinery you need to, to create a guard around that fire instantly. Before mobile office, when we responded to wildfire incident, there'd be a number of people involved, especially in the, in the mapping area of the wildfire. And now responding to a, to a wildfire with the mobile office, the user's able to reduce the number of people so that uh, more efficient on the fire. A large fire incident is, involves a lot of data transfer between the camp and the fire center in whatever district you're, you're at. Uh, as a wildfire ranger, mobile office means having the data at my fingertips available to me at all times uh, to provide effective communications between the field and the office. The Talisman, uh, essentially before that we had the mobile office uh, in, engaged with SRD, um, we had to deal with forest officers who, who were tied to their desks basically to get information. Uh, he no longer has to be in the office to have access to that hard information. He can be in the field and he can access that from any point. And uh, that immediate feedback allows us to make our, our applications that much quicker. And the economic impact of it is very significant. In our industry, uh, the time is money. And it, it basically, the quicker we can make our applications, um, the, essentially the more money we can save. And in the long run, the, the more money Albertans can get from royalties from our activities. One of the things that we are looking at is have we maximized the value yet to our other lines of business? We are also looking at partnering with our colleagues across the government of Alberta to look at how their programs could make use of the mobile office initiative and the tools and the systems within. Obviously, they would use a different information management framework to come there, but the business process you go through to creating this kind of office workspace, which is basically in a vehicle or on a quad, applies to all lines in government.